The stream is starting soon. In the meantime, enjoy some music. Hi, this is Fat Kevin, and when I'm not enjoying the conquering of 60 double cheeseburgers, I'm listening to Liam's live streams. They're so good, I like these 60 double cheeseburgers. Well, 50 died now. <laughs>
Ruga likes Liam's live streams. <laughs> they aren't bad, coming from a surface dweller. <laughs> you maggot. Welcome to the stream for August 31st, 2021. Hey! Today we're going to be finishing up the veil hey. as well as giving away a copy to one lucky no. viewer. No! No, you can't! That's my job! No! You can't take my job! What are you doing? Hey everyone and welcome to the stream for August 31st, 2021! I don't know what he thinks he's doing, but uh, that's not gonna fly. Uh, it is good to be here. I am glad to be back with more veil. I don't know what the heck he thinks he's doing. Um, and uh, listen, we've had a lot of fun with the veil. If you are just tuning in today, um, I'm going to warn you, you're going to miss a lot of story. Uh, you may want to go back and watch the archive. Not that I want to see you miss the game, because um, I don't. But, uh, you know, I, I definitely don't want you to miss um, stuff that you might want to catch. Um... Hey, to inclusion, the motto uh, apparently was under the weather is feeling better. I'm glad you're feeling better. I hope you can uh, hang out for this one. Brian McKinnish is here. Um, and yeah, fevers suck. I hope that uh, you feel better. Um, Alex is here. Liam is here. Oh, yeah, that's me. Static Master is here. Hey, Static Master, how's it going? Uh, let's see who else is here. <clears throat> Sorry if I'm a little growly. Um, you know, sometimes in the morning you're not quite, uh, not quite awake yet. You know, it takes you a little bit to get rolling. And uh, I'm a little, little, a little growly right now. But um, Trevor's here. Hey, Trevor. Uh, hey, uh, Liana. Kenny says, I already beat the game twice. Miguel is here. Uh, David says, he's taking your leadership. How rude. I, I know, it really is. Uh, I don't know what he thinks he's doing. But, uh, you know. You know, it's... What are you going to say? Hey, I do what I want. No, you don't. Stop it. You stay in your corner. Your job is to read things, and you're not you're not even ready to read things yet. So uh, why don't you just shush? So, anyways, um, how about we get to uh, some patrons? Uh, as always, and I do point this out, I do want to thank all my awesome patrons who make these streams possible. Uh, also, big thank you to people that donated after the stream was over. Um, really do appreciate it. If um, you want to donate anonymously or don't want to have your, you know, stuff read out, um, doing it after the stream is over is always a, a good thing to do. And it's appreciated. Um, big thanks to Wandering Waves, Danny Combs, Michael Lau, Kyle Smith, Munawar Vajani, James Dean, Jim Denham, Anya Kristen, Trevor Johnson, Kevin Lyons, Stephen Luttrell, Simon, Simon Yeager. Shane Davidson, Austin Nix, Sarah Hawk, Jason Smith, Michael Welty, Luna Raven, Heather Messicker, Audio Game Geek, Melissa Rowe, Hillary Duncan, Ashley Coleman, Bianca, Shane Early, Courtney Barton, Bryant, 
Roland Engelsma, Abdullah Dubase, Changeling Chad Blanco, and Jack Filichek. Um, you can become a patron at patreon.com slash Liam Irvin, and uh, it is always welcome and encouraged if you can. Um, the plan is, well, the original plan was to have all patron chat messages be read by the, um, the Liam bot. And, um, so that may work and it may not work. I'm trying to actually integrate, uh, Liam bot into Streamlabs, And if I get it integrated, um, it may change how the, um, the bot speaks because I don't, you obviously don't want the bot talking over itself, um, when super chats come in and all that stuff. Um, so, uh, got to kind of figure that out. Um, but you know, the important thing right now is just trying to get that, um, together and get that working. Oh, that's been a mess. Um, last night I was spending pouring through JavaScript code and, uh, trying to integrate uh, Liam bot into directly into Streamlabs. Um, it would make my life so much easier if it would work. But so far, I'm not having good luck. So Static Master says, I'm going to fight Liam the bot with my steel hammer. Um, okay, cool. I mean, you do what you got to do. Uh, hey, Ben, how's it going? Uh, Robo Liam is the boss. No, real Liam is the boss. Um you know, it, it, it's, I don't know. I am the boss and that boss is me. No, no, it's not you. It, oh my God. Yeah. It's going to be one of those days. Um, so, hey, Ben. Hey, everyone. Hello to all 17 of you that are tuned in. Um, if you can't donate or you don't want to donate, actually, let me throw the uh, Streamlabs link in as well. Um, I'm really bad about doing that lately. Um, just to have been... There you go. Um, either way, um, what I did want to point out was um, regardless of what you do, whether you donate or share... Um, please share these streams on your social media, uh, share them to Facebook, text your friends, uh, post them wherever you can, um, let your friends know that, uh, Hey, there's this guy out here that, uh, plays these games and, uh, it's pretty fun. Uh, Miguel says, I like your microphone. I do too. Um, it is a very nice one. Um, you should call that voice X one revised. Uh, well, I mean, not really. It sounds too much like me to be X1. Granted, I was X1. So, like, I guess it's fair. Um, so let me get my phone unlocked. Oh, wow, why is... Man, uh, Face ID isn't recognizing my face. That's embarrassing. All right. So um, what we're doing today is we're playing the veil. While we play the veil, we're also going to give away a copy of the veil. Um, the best way to enter is very simple. All you have to do is interact with the stream, interact via YouTube chat. And every so often, Nightbot will choose an entrant to go into our raffle and at the end of the game, when the game is over, originally we were going to do it yesterday, but I didn't get to finish the game. Uh, it's actually good that I, I quit when I did because I had to go do things around the house. Um, so it kind of just happened where it was really a good stopping point. I realized we would just gotten through a pretty major and intense little quest. Um, but yeah, it was it was a good stopping point. So. Uh, today, we're going to pick up on the game. We're going to finish the game today, and we're going to choose a winner. So again, if you want to be considered in that winner uh, pool, what you got to do is just, you know, chat, interact. Tell me what you think of the game. Tell me what you think of the streams. Tell me how your weather is. Let's let's talk. I want to hear from you guys. Um, Static Master says, 100% off topic. Do you use Pure Basic as a programming language? No, never have. <coughs> probably never will um 
I really, I've, I've had enough basic in my lifetime, just in general. Um, if I never have to see basic in any format again, that would be great. Um, like, uh, I worked at VB six professionally for eight years. Um, I mean, technically visual basic for applications, but it was VB six. Let's be honest. Uh, touch ID is so much better. I like face ID. Honestly, I've grown used to it. Um, hey, Seb, how's it going? Uh, do I prefer Android or iPhone? I prefer iPhone uh, mainly because everyone else I know has iPhones. Um, and uh, my ear, my hearing aids are iPhone made for iPhone. They're iPhone compliant. So I like iPhone for that reason. Um, so if there's anything else going on. So what I'm going to try to do is, is every so often I'm going to pull an eligible user. Um, if you've gotten on the list yesterday, I will redraw for that pull. I am kind of expecting that we're going to start getting duplicates. I mean, as they say, stick to the basics. Well, sometimes not so good. <laughs> um, Greg says, hi, I love the sound of this game. Listen to it yesterday. Hey, Greg, how's it going? I'm glad you like the game. Um, it is an amazing game. When, when we're done, um, I will give my overall thoughts and review on the game because I, I do have a lot to say, both good and bad. So I, I do want to talk about it. So uh, stick around. I mean, once the game's over, we are going to talk a little bit. We'll chat. And uh, I want to talk about the game. I want to give my impressions and um, throw some thoughts out there. But hard to give your impressions if you haven't finished a game. So maybe we should start doing that, huh? Maybe we should uh, get going. Uh, do you like the voiceover Braille keyboard? Oh, yeah, I, I use it all the time. Um, I like the spatial audio feature. Honestly, I don't notice a difference. To me, it's just music. Um, Liana says, I love the game. Yeah, I do too. I'm really happy with this game. Like I said, I've, I've got a number of thoughts. Um, we're going to kind of get to that. But um, how about we get to that? All right. Here we go. Let me grab my controller. Here's the controller. Also, I need to get the fish out of here. We got the got the fishies in the background. All right. So let's get the veil going. And here we go. Falling Squirrel and Creative Bytes Studios presents The Veil. Press the start button or space bar to begin. Main menu. Continue game. All right. So we're going to continue from where we left to off. Now, uh, we had just finished a quest with the pigeons. Where to now? We're pretty much done. We should think about setting out. When you are ready to travel, press the back or select button to bring up the character now, menu and select Somebody the had map. mentioned to me that we should probably look at... Um, checking out the smith because I might have missed some stuff this is a very busy town What do you need? Arms and armor. Push down on the left stick to cycle through items of interest. Press left trigger to leave. Got a battle axe. My specialty is armor. 
Yeah, chains well riveted and oil. Yeah, the wife's a bow maker. Glade Longbowman know her work. So, 100 copper for one of these would be a steal. Oh. Press the right trigger to use the left stick item quality. Tier 3 bow. Your current item is tier 2 bow. This item. Yep, we're going to buy that. There you are. Push down on the left. Got a battle axe. My specialty is armor. All right. I'll be going now. So, I got Thank a new you. bow. Hey, Dominic, how's it going? Character men travel map. Press. We are here in Greeley. No Bella, still four days according to the old man's map. Press right trigger to proceed. Left trigger to remain at this location. All right, so we're going to proceed to Nobel. And here we go. Yeah, no problem. I understand. It was late. I also love that uh, we have a dog. Drive her off, Alex. Please don't. She's welcome to travel with us. Though I wish I could explain to her the danger that follows us. So are you able to go with... Oh, well, what a coincidence. Oh. We just so happen to be leaving at the same time. Where's your sizable friend? Oh, he's laid out for a bit, I'm afraid. No matter how tough you are, there's always someone tougher, I suppose. Oh. Didn't cost me a thing, though. The fight was on his own time. Oh. Anyway, I'm looking to head east and figured we could share the road a ways. You can lighten the burden on my mule cart. Clarence here is a great companion, more talkative than Darko, but not quite as useful in a sticky situation, if you know what I mean. We'll be safer together, right? You with your steel, me with my silver tongue. What do you say? Alex, a word. The hunting trails on this map may not be our best option. With the fate after you, we may be better off on the road. And our friend here could draw off attackers if we run into trouble. You would use him as fodder? If Oded didn't come looking for you, yes, as a last resort. Either way, he's still safer with us. Push down on the left stick to cycle option. We'll take the road with the merchant. Press right trigger to... Follow the hunting path. Press right trick. The road? You see your point. The more the merrier. Wonderful! I'll tie down <laughs> the fish barrels. Oh boy. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's like. So, where will you go with the hall between us and the capital? Well, a merchant need follow the coin wherever it leads. And that hoard has the bulk of the kingdom's riches at the moment. You're not afraid they'll just plunder you too? It wouldn't be the first time or the last. But the hoard has coin to spend and they'll need us merchants to keep supplies coming. You'd profit from the invasion? It's either that or starve. <laughs> Easy, girl. It's the Odedin. Where are you going? We can't be seen, Dennis. No, you, you can't leave me. Besides, where are you going to hide? We're in a bloody pasture. Get a wagon. Yes, the wagon. Hurry, into the empty barrels. Shepard? I don't think we have a choice. <sighs> smells awful. Well, lucky for you, I sold out a smelt. If things out here go sideways, you'll burst from the barrel, taking my attackers unawares, right? Yes. Shut the lid. What's in the barrels? Fish. Old fish. What is your dog barking at? My dog? Oh! Right, my dog. He doesn't like fish. Smart dog. Mm. It isn't for everyone, I know. Can I interest you in some Highland Ale? It's my last barrel. Hmm. Not bad. We'll take it. That will be 30 copper. Just let it go. I said, we'll take it. We should do something. Don't you dare, Alex. Press the right trigger to leap out of barrel. Whoa, well, no, no, no. 15 copper, my final offer. Stay back. What's this about? Alex, we're dipping. Keep up, girl. 
Taking a beating here. Flex. Are the worst. It came out well in the end. Get the donkey moving. We need to get off this road. See, I, once you get into this, man, I really enjoy the fighting system. Um, it's simple, what is it, Carl? but it's. Oh. Shepard, Dennis, hold up. Alex? What's she growling at? Something in the woods. A squirrel, maybe. No. There's something else there. I see a hunting track. And no reason to follow it. Press right trigger to enter. Left trigger to leave. I can't explain it. But I need to know what's there. Wait on the road, Dennis. Oh. All right. <laughs> I love how each weapon has different sounds. No nice each. This is not natural. Wait, Shepard. I hear something. Coming from the wood. Something. A relic. Close by. And something else. More devils. I hear them. I need to make it to the relic. You wait here, Shepard. Guard the way out. Please be careful, Alex. So we're going for a relic. I don't know if there's any funny tricks here. Oh, is that a wolf? Got it. Did I just own another wolf? I did. Yeah, glad you're here, Lukash. Um, in about a few minutes, I'm going to choose another entrant for the raffle. So, I would suggest that you guys keep interacting. There we go. Choose which hand will absorb the relic. All right, I'm going to put it right into trigger will shield. Oh. 
Alex! Uncle? Is that you? Yes. Where are you? I don't rightly know. Between places, I feel. I fear. Are you alive? Not as such. I'm just... here. What happened? We were fighting. Losing. Then... darkness. Are you with the Fae? I believe they are calling me. To some purpose. Warriors to a cause. Oh. Uncle? What is it, Alex? You always said that honesty is the greatest gift a princess could receive. And that is true. Yes. You stole my birthright. Is that true, Uncle? You conspired with the Queen and my father to place Theo before me. I'm afraid the full truth is even darker. How? Your grandmother's first instinct was to rob you of more than just the crown. I persuaded her to consider a more sensible option. You must know now why I've been training you all these years. If the truth got out and there was a challenge, I wanted you to be an able protector. I don't want the crown. That may not be your choice to make. Uncle? Oh. Uncle. What was it? What did you see? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing I want to talk about. Let's go from this place. All right. So let's pick a winner. Or not a winner, but let's pick a entrant. Again, this does not mean that you are automatically winning a copy of the game. This means you are entered in to a raffle. And inclusion of the motto. You are our next entrant. So you're going to go into the list of people. And we will decide. Well, we'll pick. Random.org will decide at the end of the stream. Who wins a copy of the game? Very cool. All right. So let me catch up with a couple of messages. Um, hey, Doomfire, how's it going? Um, man, that's not good. Killing the dead uncle. Well, I don't think we kill them. But it's very interesting. Yes, the game can be played with a keyboard or a controller. All right, let's get back to the game. Game options. I remember this crossroad. Summershire is some of the finest wines in all of Glades. Never stopped it, though, on account of drinking more than I would sell. I always liked the name Summershire. I imagined the people to be warm and friendly year-round. The crossroads seem a little too quiet, even for this late in the season. Is there something you're not telling me? The fields. Someone has taken a torch to them. Oh. Oh. The harvest would have been in well before the Odedon arrived. We can ask at the village. The place is deserted. They've had the sense to flee. Except for the smith. Sounds like it. I wonder what that's about. Let's go find out. I should go and water Clarence. You go ahead. I love how his mule is named Clarence. That's great. All right. It's so quiet. Peaceful. Come before the storm, they say. Right, let's go talk. Where you are. 
unless you want to bolt through the eye. She has a crossbow aimed at your head. I gathered. Thank you. Uh, we're just passing through. Where to? Nobel. <laughs> and how are you going to do that? There's a no dead in camp at every crossing from here to Maidenpool. What happened to your fields? Where have you been? The army burned everything on this side of the river. The king's army? The new king's a bloody coward. Didn't think we were worth defending. Why would he burn your crops? To starve out the horde. Force them to spread out in search of food. Why did you stay? I won't see savages looting the manor house. Me and the husband and two other families are all up in the mill. I can't believe my brother would do this. Your brother? Her brother is a captain in the army. Is there anything we can do to help? Funny you should ask. A small group of Odedden are sitting on our last grain store in the North Field. Your brother and his friends didn't burn it all. We'll need to take it back if we hope to survive the winter. You appear to be in lack of sight. Is that weapon of yours for show? It is not. We plan to move on them tonight. We've had some experience with the Odedden. Oh, in that case, the husband's work in the forge. Best weapon smithing glades. Go see him if you need anything, and meet us at the mill if you intend to join us. I know you want to move on, but perhaps we should just ask at the forge in the mill before we leave. I'd like to find a place for our girl here before we head to the river. So now you can hear the mill. This is really interesting. What are you after, eh? Your wife sent us. I was talking to the dog here. There's a good girl, there's a good girl, eh? So Cass recruited you for the raid tonight, eh? She did. I trust you have coin. Raid or not, I don't work for free. How do you plan on making a living in this empty village? Ah, this'll pass. Heads roll, crowns are stolen, banners change colour. But horses will always need shoeing and sword sharpening. Push down on the left stick to cycle through ice. What are you carrying? Oh, that's good steel. But I could improve on that. Temper it, have it oiled and razor sharp. Press the right trigger Ooh. to consider. I was working on this plate armor when the horde came. Looks like it would fit you. No. Press the right. I have this shield, see? It was a decent piece of oak the wife found, and I've banded the back. Press the right trigger. Use Take the left stick to cycle item stats. Press right item quality. Tier 5 shield. Your current item is tier 4 she guard break chance reduction. 50%. Right, Your I'm gonna current item get this, is um, 45%. I'm gonna... Um, this item will cost... Yeah, I'm gonna get the shield. Wear it well. Push down on... You want your sword improving? The plate? Press the right trigger to cons... You want your sword... Use the left stick to cite item quality. Tier 6 sword. Ooh. Critical chance bonus. 55. Heavy attack critical chance bonus. 70%. See, I don't use heavy attack. Your critical damage multiplier. 3. Your heavy attack. Critical I damage. Should, heavy though. attack. Gar attack speed. Endurance recovery. Coin value. 300 copper. Your This item will cost 100. But It'll be ready before you leave tonight. Push down on the left stick to the plate. All right. Press. I'll be going now. Thank you. So I think Where we're now. Think we should think about setting out. We should also consider helping the townsfolk here recover their stores. We are absolutely going to help the townsfolk. Who's this, Cass? Travelers headed to Nobel. Word is, they know how to handle all dead and warriors. So what do you say? You ready to move on the savages? Don't do this, Alex. We're so close. Press right trigger to take up this quest. I'd like to make amends for the suffering my brother may have caused you. An honorable thing. We'll head out now, before anyone has second thoughts. Call Emmett down from the loft. <coughs> we will do, Cass. I'm done with this, Alex. W what do you mean? 
I'm done with swamps, beastings, fires, hostages, pirates, chasing horses, raising the dead, taking in stray animals, orphans, monster babies. Have I missed anything? Giant living statues with hammers? It's not a joke, Alex. You are a stone's throw from home. That's it, isn't it? You don't want to go home. What would I say to Theo? After what I've learned? Say nothing. Return to your brother. Be a princess. Live in a castle. I think I'm done with castles. I don't want to go back living with sheep. But it's what I do. If I am the queen, then my duty is to serve the people of the kingdom. The people of this village. So be it. But I'm sick of watching you risk your life. I'll be waiting here. In case you return. Okay. The camp just on the other side of the edge row. I can see eight of them around the fire. Could be more nearby. <coughs> here. Take a little honey for the cough. Bless you. Didn't Just see a bow. Taste of it lifts the spirits. You don't need our help to get around. On even ground? No. Then I say we rush them. Take them unawares. Or we could draw them out with bows. Take a few down before they can reach us. Here we go. Nice. Who's next? That was kind of cool. Same. This uh, I'm sorry. This combat is so much fun. I've never seen something quite like you. I won't question it. You've saved us. It was the least I could do. You're welcome to take anything of value from this camp. Hey, John. It's little use to us. We'll bring a cart by on the morrow to move the stores to the village. Hey, Werner. You have gained 150 copper in coin and salvage. Nice. Who's a good girl? You satisfied now? It needed to be done, Shepard. Then you're ready to go home. As ready as I'm going to be. Where to now? We should think about setting out. Alright, so I'm gonna check the smith. I'm gonna go back and see if he's got anything else. Just because we have a chance to go look.
What do you need? Just having a look. Push down on the lip. I was working on this plate armor. Right, when he has the whole... I'll be going else. now. Thank you. Now, Where to now? We I should think about think something else. We're good. I'm gonna go check the the well really quick. But I think we're probably done. Not this way. Nope. Alright, I think we've done everything. I don't I mean I could be missing stuff. Again, I'm not trying to uh one hundred percent this. Hey Jessica, how's it going? Character menu. Travel map. Summer sure must be about here on the map. Press right trigger. All right, let's do the it. The causeway should lead us to the bridge. You ready for this? 500 miles. All I right. don't think we may actually make it. So, no, there may not be a lot left. We're going to see. I mean, obviously, I think we got a big conclusion coming. Cassia was willing to part with 20 casks of Summershire's finest. If Dennis can sail to the old dead and ahead of your arrival, it should make your trip through the camp a tad easier. It will. Farewell, Dennis. I suppose this is it, then. It's been a pleasure traveling with you folks. <laughs> we'll see you on the other side. I like Dennis. There's a path that runs through the marshy ground alongside the main road. That'll take you right to the Tower Bridge. If you stay off the causeway and move at night, you should be able to move between the camps unnoticed. Thank you, Cass. Thank you, Alex, for everything. And take good care of girl for us. She seems to like it here. So that's her name. Guru. <laughs> I was afraid to become attached. I was about princess. Sure. Princess. Take care, Alex. Come, princess. All right. Before I change my mind, let's go home, Shepard. Alex. Wait. What is it? You know I don't belong here. In Glades. Why not? On the other side of that river, you'll become a queen. I'll still be a shepherd from the borderlands. You saved me. You'll be a hero. You, you want your reward, don't you? I will help you get across that river. But that's as far as I will go. Nonsense. We'll speak no more of this. Is that an order? See? You are already acting like a queen. I wonder what his deal is. We're at the Valley Ridge, Alex. What can you see? I see the Tower Bridge. It's quite impressive. And the Horde? I have never seen 5,000 people in one place before. Their camps are spread out along the river. They're building barges where the river narrows to the south. There's a camp building catapults. Can't be Odedin. Must be the Mara or some other enemy of Glade who's joined the cause. Nothing brings the realm together like hatred of my family. The way down is steep, Alex. You'll need to take my hand. Okay. Hmm. The sun just set. I felt its warmth leave. Why do you sound sad? It'll be dark soon. You'll have your advantage back. My advantage? In the dark, you shine, Alex. Trust me. I do. I trust you. It's why I need you to stay with me in Glades. There's something in the clearing up ahead. It's getting colder still. I can hear something. Ooh. Greetings, Alexandra. I know that voice. It's an Odedin woman. She's alone. You're the General's seer. The General's? I belong to no one in this realm. What do the Fae want of me? Of you? Absolutely nothing. You do not have your brother's resolve. His willingness to fight to the last. So it's a pointless war they want? Far from pointless. This war will bring about great change. In the only realm that matters. Mm. When a warrior falls in this world, they rise to fight again in another. Why do the Fae want an army? That is no concern of ours. 
no concern. The Fae are orchestrating the death of thousands of soldiers of both our nations. Who will rise again in service of a greater cause. Every one of us serves the Fae. Whether we know it or not, they were here before us. They will be here long after we are gone. I will not serve them. That is why you must die. Oh, jeez. The dead rise. of our newest recruits. She's disappeared. She's still here. I can hear her energy. She's using a relic. <laughs> Hit her with your bow! Because they have to be in my bad ear. to get to the witch or this will never end
I'm sorry. Uncle? Oh. No. Oh, no. They will not be stopped. Good. Excellent. Oh, no. She's gone. Vanished. <laughs> wow. It's okay, Alex. I'm sorry, Shepard. Please. Please don't leave me. I will see you home. This is it, Alex. Okay. The Odetan horde is directly ahead. The ground is marshy alongside the causeway and the fog is thick. But there are fewer camps here. If we're quiet, we have a chance to make it to the river. You ready? Yes, Shepard. Okay. I'm going to pick uh, another raffle winner. Uh, again, if you are chosen, this does not mean that you win the game. This just means that you are entered to win. Um, so Static Master is our next entrance. So paste that in. All right, we'll probably do one or two more to add to the list, and then we'll draw at the end. We're getting close. Uh, yeah, James says, honestly, the uh, story is amazing. I feel really bad for the people that judge it for its gameplay. Yeah, no, I, I, I agree. I think this is really an awesome story. And I, the gameplay Push does not the bother Together. me at all. Together. Your ears, my eyes against the night fog and marsh. After you. All right. Here we go. Next village, we get proper drunk. What did you say about my mother? <clears throat> Show yourself. I found them. With me, like. Flame on.
It worked! It worked! Awesome. That was so cool. That the was fog is too thick. Which way to the river? That was so cool. There's one more large camp up ahead. Then it's empty road all the way to the tower bridge. Well, well. This looks promising. What do you have for us? Wine from Somershire. It's our merchant friend. Well-timed distraction. Marat told me I could get a fair price from this camp. So you get first choice of vintages. Marat sent you? It's probably swill. <laughs> Let's have at it. Hold on. Hold on. Let's talk price first. We drink the wine first. Then we tell you what it's worth. All right, then. Who am I to argue? Hey, where are you off to? Now, leave that here. What is it? They are calling the warriors. To battle? Already? No, not yet. Honor rituals. They're coming this way. Keep walking, Alex. I'll hold them up. No! We'll stay together. Sorry, Alex. It's too late. Where are you headed? The captains are calling us. I'd stay clear of that ground ahead. We'll lose the horse in it. What band are you with? And why are you dressed like that? Look at his hands. He's not a warrior anymore. Are you going to answer? Oh. What band are you with? He might be a spy. I'm with the Okita. Then come with us. If you're lying, you'll be the first sacrifice of the night. Let him go! Damn you, Alex! Run! I said, let him go! Uh, clearly, they're up to something. Go kill her! Nice. So that is interesting. Did anyone catch that? If you didn't, you should have. Very interesting. Coming. You need to run. I'm not leaving you. Damn it, Alex. Oh, I thought that was you. What with all the bodies strewn about? Get on this horse. Both of you. Don't say Dennis Cranberry weren't a hero. Now, 
Not the wind! Yeah! Yeah! Weapon out, Alex! Here they come! Oh, sweet. We're fighting horseback. Die. From the tower, Alex. We're at the bridge, Alex. Hold your fire! I am Princess Alexandra. I have made the 500-mile journey home with the help of my companion here. Do I know any of you? The Princess would. It's Adder from the King's Guard. Adder Hamblin, son of Burton, who served in the King's Guard with my uncle Ivor. Here's the Princess. Open the gate, quickly. Mine, I'll bring her in, and someone go tell the King. Ooh. I'm sorry, Alex. For what? We've made it. You must know this, Alex. I don't regret seeing you home. Why would you? You in the cloak, who are you? Reveal yourself. Alex. Shepard. Get down from there. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, he's with me. Oh, dead and filth. He has the warrior markings, my lady. He's one of them. Alex! What's happening? He's an old dead and spy hiding under a cloak. What? What? No. No, he's a shepherd from the borderlands. I'm sorry, Alex. You've been deceived, my lady. Oh. Take him to the keep. We might have something we can beat out of him. Wait. No. Calm yourself, my lady. We need to get you through the gate. No. Shepherd! Shepherd! Oh, boy. Oh, man. It's like everything's going sideways. Come with us, my lady. What's happening? The king wants you moved to the city. We're beginning the assault. The fools have set up camp in range of our arches. I need to speak with my brother. Plenty of time for that after we expel the ore. It's just soldier stuff for now. Come on, come with me. Let go of me. Alex. Theo? You're alive. I was afraid to hope it was true. 500 miles on your own. You, my sister, are a miracle. No. No, I had help. A shepherd. The Odedan spy. We need to talk, Theo. About the Odedan. There's little time for that. I just wanted to see you before this begins. You can't fight them. So much has been lost already. We must treat with them. You can't reason with animals, Alex. They're not animals. Are you referring to the one we've just caged? Yes. They have honor, codes, families. We can reason with them. 5,000 barbarians marched 500 miles to camp in the shadow of the Tower Bridge. And they will be going nowhere but in the ground. Theo, wait. What? You said you would always protect me. And I will, Alex. You'll be safe in the city. What if I were meant to protect you? How? I've witnessed things. Things that make it very clear dark forces have orchestrated this conflict. What dark forces? Forces we cannot see. The Fae. You've gone mad, Alex. Even surrender would be preferable to facing them. Do you think you would make a better king than I? Good kings, listen. I just want you to consider what I have to say. I've seen the trap set for both armies. You've seen nothing. You marched into our kingdom on the arm of our enemy. And you didn't even know it. He is not our enemy. And you are marching to your death. Then you will take the throne. And be free to rule as you see fit. Goodbye, Alex. Theo. Archers are ready, my lord. On my command. Theo! Archers ready! The king wants you to come with us, my lady. My lady! Get your hands off of me! What was that? Not possible. What happened? The Tower Bridge Gate just collapsed. The Fae. They're crossing the bridge! Shields up, men! 
Wow. Oh yeah, we're fighting now. Wow. Oh. Alex. Shepard. Where are we? Where are we? Summershire. We're about to head out. Whoa. Whoa. Are you okay? Summershire. Yes. Wait, what? Course. On the other side of the river, you'll become a queen. And you'll be just another warrior in the Odedan army. How long have you known? It just occurred to me now. You've seen something again? Yes. Whoa! Who are you exactly? An Odedan archer. I fell in the attack on your caravan. Odedan armies leave their wounded to fend for themselves. Why did you help me? It was not my intention to help you. I wanted to present you to our general myself. To take the credit. You were easier to guide than drag. What would I have been worth? I don't know. Promotion, a good marriage, perhaps a thousand sheep. I have no one. Alex. I kept my promise to bring you home, and I will see it through. The road home leads only to death and destruction. What then? I need you to help me stop a war. Save my brother, my kingdom. And how would we do that, hmm? We are going to complete your mission. You are going to hand me over to your general. And what would that accomplish? A good king listens. Would he treat with me? Long enough to say he's going to kill you. Then he'll pick up his hammer and crush you with it. I think this is the only chance we have. I've seen the alternative. The Fae want death and that is what they will get. How could we know what the Fae want? You're right. Perhaps they don't want you to get that promotion. <laughs> but what do we have to lose in the face of all-out war? All right. It may not be that simple to get you to the general. Boy, alive. that was cool. You may want to visit the smith before we leave. Oh my gosh. All right. Good story. I apologize to anyone who is catching this and didn't start from the beginning. Wow. I what do you need? Did not Just having a look. That. Push down on the lip. Right, I was working armor. on this plate armor when okay. the horde. I'll be going now. Thank you. When you are ready to travel, character, travel equipment, travel map. Wow. Summershire must be here at the start of the causeway. The main camp was just on the north side. I'm hoping we can walk right in. Are you sure you're ready for this? Press right trigger. Yes. Wow. We'll need to reach him before they begin the assault. It's And it's amazing because the fight that I had... I, none of that happened. Dang. I can see the camps ahead. We're nearly there. How did your general come to lead the army? Well, for one, he's nearly seven feet tall. And not a slender seven feet. Most importantly, he's cunning. He can murder at will, but he knows when to stay his hand. And that surrounds him with captains who have influence among the ranks. He also chose captains with families and they reside on his estate. He's generous to them, but they are essentially hostages. So these captains love their families? I would hope so, yes. Do you hear that? Hello again, Alexandra. The General oh. Seer. Oh! You remember? We shared the vision, yes. And this time, you seek us out. I'm here to treat with your General. The guards are coming. Go ahead. Play your little game. The outcome will scarce be different. 
She's gone. I didn't see where. Who's there? You can do this, Shepard. I said, who's there? Abdel Rashid of the Okita. I have a prisoner to present to General Farthalo. A prisoner? From where? It's the lost princess of Glades. Really? Doesn't look much like a princess. Why is she in armor? It's how I found her. All right. She can come with us. I will not be denied the chance to present her to the general. Listen, Akita. You don't even have a captain on the council. So you are going to do as I say. What if I'm wrong about this being the princess? Are you willing to take credit for that too? All right. Mm. Come along, both of you. We have a prisoner. What's happening? Your terrible plan appears to be working. The general is coming out of his tent. Oh, jeez. What is this about? This warrior has brought you a prisoner. An ambassador to treat with you, my general. <laughs> An ambassador. My name is Alexandra Denholm. I am the Queen of Glades and protector of the city of Nobel. It was my understanding that a whelp named Theo is the one they call king here. Theo is my younger brother and the leader of a massive army that awaits you on the other side of the Tower Bridge. Whoever you are, we care nothing of kings or queens. We are here to prove that birthrights mean nothing. That title means nothing, and that you have no claim to anything in this world. I believe that dark forces have led you here, have led to this confrontation, a battle that will surely destroy both of our armies. We are here because you cannot stop us. I implore you and your captains to return home to your families. As queen, I promise there will be no retribution on the Odedan homeland if you return now. Together, we must resist the forces that would destroy us all. You there is no glory happen, right? in this fight. No glory. You're not wrong about that. Someone please kill this girl. I have grown tired of her. If you want the kingdom, you will have to take it from me yourself. Kill her! Take your weapon, Alex. So satisfying. Oh, I like fire. Oh. I am Queen Alexandra of Glades. You, General, question my worthiness to rule, and yet you are too much of a coward to face a blind woman in battle. Bring me my ham. Yes! We cannot be stopped. Oh, 
say that. <laughs> For you. Fire! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh. Did I kill him? You've done it, Alex. Your general is defeated. Now go! You owe him nothing! Go home to your families! Go home before my brother's army crosses the river! What are they doing? Leaving. <laughs> They're leaving. Come with me. We'll be safer on the causeway. Wow! Oh, that was fun. What's happening now? The horde is walking into the sunset. The general sounds like Shogun. Describe it for me. I'll try. I see a vast river of my kin, flowing westward down the vale. No banners fly, no spears aloft. But they still float on the current. Perhaps lifted by thoughts of home. Thank you. Wow. It looks like your brother is sending a small party across the bridge now. They will be here in moments. They will not treat you kindly. I know. We'll leave together. I'll return to my seat in the borderlands, if they will have me. If you leave, who will stay your brother's hand? Is he not your father? Your grandmother? You are the only hope for peace. Where are you going? They will never trust you as long as I am here. Don't you dare. I will return home and speak to anyone who will listen about what you did here today. Please, don't. I need you. Who will be my guide? You see more clearly than anyone I have ever met. Goodbye, Alex. Shepard. Shepard! Wow. All right, the we're, we're going to pick one more person. We're going to throw one more into the mix. And it was Stephen Crouch. So, uh, it looks like we're at the end of the game. So let's catch the end. Game options. King is dead. It was not a hero's death. It was the death of an idea. A dream of my father's. Theo agreed to return the Borderlands to the local tribes in exchange for peace. My brother is still ruler of Nobel, and he is none the wiser of my claim to the throne. Theo is strong, and just, and well-loved enough. And he has me. I continue to listen to the world around me. I listen to people in need. I listen for word of my loyal shepherd and the couple in the mountain. And I listen very carefully for the murmur of sinister forces that may seek to harm us. And when they come again, I will be ready. Wow. What a... What a good game. Fade to black. Thank uh, you for playing The Veil, Shadow of the Crown. 
This game was created by a very small core team of developers, supported and mentored by hundreds of friends from the games industry and the blind and low vision community. For a screen reader accessible list of credits, please visit our website at fallingsquirrel.com. Press left trigger at any time to return to the main menu. All right. I'm going to skip the credits. You guys are more than welcome to read them on your own. Um, main menu. That. Contista. Tutorial. Game. All right. Game. Credit. Quit. Game. Let's. Let's talk, huh? I am glad that I did stop the stream when I did. Like I said, I know we could have done it in one um, stream. But uh, I, I'm glad that we're doing a separate one because now we can talk a little bit more. All right. So our last entry is in. Is that me or is that an invitation to a sequel says Roland? I hope. Oh, I hope so. Oh, ha, ha. So. Um, all right. Well, it said Ben Jackshaw has won. Why did it say? All right, so Ben was already on the list. Why am I seeing Steven? I thought he was not. Hold on, I'm confused. All right, maybe I was wrong. I'm sorry. I, I hate Nightbot. Um, Ben is already on the list. All right, so let's see. So I'm going to redraw one more because Ben is already on. I thought it said Steven. I'm sorry. Let me re... All right. So it says Kesha V. All right. Sorry, Steven. I did not... I For whatever reason, I'm not looking at chat, so... Thanks. All right. So um, I'm going to throw Kesha V in here. And we're going to draw in just a moment. There are 15 entries. Um, so how about we do a quick random.org? I need a random number. Integer generator. Okay. So uh, I'm going to... All right. So I need one integer. One and 15... All right, so we have 15 entries, and the winner is number 11, which is Matvij, Le oh God, I can't pronounce his name, I, I believe he said Matthew, so congratulations to Matthew whose name I cannot pronounce. Um, so hopefully I can get a hold of them. I actually don't know how I'm going to do that with YouTube. Um, but they are the winner. I'll make sure to put up a post letting you guys know, and hopefully I hear from them. And uh, we will get in contact, and uh, they won a game. Uh, on the off chance that they don't want the game, um, we'll do another draw. In fact, I will. Uh, I'll draw later if I need to. Um, so now that the game is over, let's talk about it. Um, let's talk about the good, the bad, the ugly. So I have a lot of good. Um, the audio design is amazing. Um, I, I can't even begin to tell you how good the design is it is like if you took um i i just like 
everything with the design is amazing. Weapons sound different. There is sounds for people moving around. Obviously, they're real objects. Um, one of the things that we found out later in the game is you saw that there was a guy that came in to attack me. I actually shot him before he got to me. Um, so that attention to, to detail is amazing. Um, I love that. I really, truly adore that. Um, the... All right, we can close that. We can close that. All right. Um, the attention to detail is amazing. The story is awesome. Listen, it's a good story. Um, I realize that there's a lot of people that were like, well, this is dumb. It's another blind protagonist. Da, da, da. I'm okay with this. This didn't bother me. Um, I was okay with this because eventually the game sort of explains it. The game kind of fills us in as to why we have a blind protagonist, why this is happening, what's going on. Um, Roland says, sounds are rich, time relative music, well composed. Um, nothing weird. No, and it it really is flawless. Um, so that was cool. Um, the Like I said, the story was amazingly well written. Um, I got completely uh tossed on that whole um plot twist that was amazing i did not see that coming i don't think any of us did unless you played the game um the voice acting is really good now i'm gonna say and this might be more in my bad i feel that the acting could have been a little better um i feel like there could have been more people one of the problems I know was that this was being done during a pandemic. Um, I don't know how many people they were able to get in to record. It may have been possible they, they had to duplicate up on lines instead of getting more people. Because um, I know one of the things that they did was they recorded in a studio. Now, that being said, the voice acting is not awful. Um, it's, it's good. I mean, it... There are some really great voice actors and there are some very talented people. I would have liked a wider array of actors, but you know, you work with the resources you have and I feel like the resources they had were, um, you know, like they used what they had really well. Uh, Roland says, and it's not like she's the only blind person either and not the other oh, I'll rule the kingdom and it makes sense to see the future. Yeah. Like, I mean, I love the whole concept of the seers. I love that people that are blind for whatever reason are seers. It's just the way it works. Um, it's some cool lore. Yeah. It takes a little bit to really explain to you, but it's explained well. Um, also the fight with your uncle, I don't think is canon. And that was interesting too. Um, I don't think that's canon. So, I mean, I love the idea of the seeing the visions and then being able to, like, change the outcome and go back. I thought that was so cool. Um, it's just, it's well written. It's cool. Uh, the combat scenes were awesome. So, listen, the combat is amazing in this game. The combat controls, I know, are a little, for some people, are like, uh. But listen, it's done in a way... That is still really engaging. And I recommend if you can play it with a controller. Um, it is so fun. And it's so much fun when you're actually using two sticks, one for each arm, you're controlling your shields, you're throwing up magical spells. I mean, just really well done. Um, Brian says, I like the tavern where the guys were singing. Listen, that may have been one of the coolest pieces of environmental audio. Um, for those that missed it, there's a tavern that you're walking in and there's um, a band playing and singers singing and you actually hear the singers on one side, the band on the other. As you move, everything moves. It's, oh, it's beautiful. Uh, am I going to play this game again? Um, I don't know, actually. I don't know if I would. I, I mean, I don't see any reason not to. Um, I might be interested in trying a different set of like weapons, so maybe trying a hammer maybe trying something different. Um, 
there are definitely some story choices I would like to make that would change the outcome. I'd be very interested in what would happen if I don't take the dog. If I can avoid taking the dog, I'm curious how things change. I'm curious um, how different paths play out. Obviously, you can choose which path you take. Um, the uncle fight made me say out loud, holy hell. Yeah, me too. Um, you guys heard? I said, oh, no. Like, it really was, like, really intense. And the thing is, it evoked emotion. Uh, a, blind le- a, a blind legend never evoked any motion, emotion in me. Probably the only game in the last few years that evoked um, emotion was uh, Bulwark. And it was more of a sense of, like, wonder um, and awe and amusement. Um, and that was, like, a small little indie game. Um, the um, This game really kind of got me engaged. Um, that, uh, fight was scary. It was scary. It was like intense. Um, combat is for both sided who need to get used to fighting like this and also new to not too overwhelming for new audio gamers. Yeah. Listen, I feel like the combat's well balanced as far as the controls go. Um, I feel like there's enough going on where it's engaging enough. But, you know, as I brought up yesterday, and I'm going to point this out again, and something that people need to keep in mind is the game was designed for everybody. And part of that means that it's it is kind of designed for people that, yes, play audio games. But really, the market is the mainstream community. And the idea is to get people playing a game that has no visuals, that has no audios or that has audio and that these people have never played before. So. Um, things to us that may seem simplistic or dumb are going to be very advanced for users that have never played it before. Um, I was part of the beta testers. I'm doing a challenge right now with hard mode without upgrading equipment. Oh, that's interesting. Um, I like the pat part where you're killing rats and the voices were echoing as if it sounded like you're in the room. Yeah, I mean, the, the use of um, environmental audio, binaural um, impulse responses was amazing. Um, so it was very impressive. Um, so I guess if I had to, let me, I mean, let me try to think of some things I didn't like. So one thing I don't like is how linear the game is. So um, you can't explore the world. There is no sort of like open world going on. And I understand that it's a story and that you're traveling and that's cool. And that once you go forward, you go forward. But um, there was a lost sort of thing here that could have been done that wasn't done um now again they are an indie studio and so what they can do is limited so i kind of temper my expectation with that knowledge so the fact that it's not a massive open world game is a downer but it doesn't destroy the game um it's just linear and that's okay sometimes sometimes you know what you need a good linear story I know that the community has really been crying out for like a massive open world thing that they can get lost in and just explore uh, like a giant sandbox. And um, I hope that that happens one day. But uh, I also think people need to temper expectations. So that to me was a downside. You are like you're going to end up in one place. That's the way it goes. Um, There is like towns to explore, but like it's essentially... To me, it was like this. Travel a road, enter a town, do quests in that town, upgrade equipment, travel a road, enter that town, do quests in that town, uh, upgrade equipment, travel a road, enter. So you see where I'm going. What really saves it, though, are all the good things I listed. The story, the amazing sound work, the really engaging combat and not just engaging from a control perspective, but engaging from audio. There's a lot going on and there's lots of things to take in and really enjoy. Um, 
Steven says, I'm going to say this. The Veil is probably the best ever to be released in 2021. Yeah, I would say no question. Um, I, I, there's nothing else I can think of that even comes close at all, ever. Um, I like the last fight with the general, says Werner. I did too. I mean, I, you kind of knew that they was going to go there. We knew there was going to be a general fight. Um, it was very rewarding, I felt. It was just exciting. I enjoyed it. Uh, I loved how we, you know, went through that fight and it, it just, it tied the story together. I also love the ending of the story. Like, you know, our character does not become queen. They kind of hang out in the shadows and they'll be back. And, and I hope so. Um, I hope so. I want a sequel. Yes. There's also vibration. If you're playing on a controller. Yes, there is. Um, and I, I, Got, I'm so used to that from other games that I don't even think about it anymore. But it, it, if you're new to that sort of thing, it really is cool. Um, uh, I wonder, for instance, how people, oh, side people dealt with the singing tavern and the wind. Yeah, I mean, um, I don't know. I think some of its trial and error. The game is, is pretty, listen, it's pretty forgiving. Um, but there is a lot to do and i i do think that there will be people going all right i'm i'm not i'm done um i don't know what visuals there are on screen i don't know how much is actually going on but i don't think there really is enough to do much i think it's more display um so yeah i mean i don't know I, I, I'm really, I don't know, but it was fun. I have to say, I'm really impressed. I'm sorry I didn't get to play this weeks ago for you guys. Um, I know that that was something that we wanted to do, and I apologize again for just not getting to it. I was out of town, and some other things have been going on, and I just, that was one of the reasons I went out of town, was to just um, take some time away so they could get some stuff done around the house, and uh, I needed it for me as well. So, that is The Veil. Um, again, big congratulations to Matt something. Um, but they are the winner. I will make sure to make a post. Uh, hopefully they will comment on this video and we can, uh, get the ball rolling. Um, you know, if, if you are them or you know them, let them know to drop me an email or a tweet or something. Um, we'll coordinate and get them a copy of the game on the off chance they don't want it. Um, they can either give it to somebody else or we can redraw. Uh, would be cool if completing would allow you to go back freely through the world. It would. I would love to be able to explore this area and travel and hunt and do things. Um, it would, I mean, it would be cool, like the natural progression. Uh, I enjoyed the controller. I love, yeah, using the stick and um, pushing it forward slightly to sneak. Um, I do actually wonder, oh, if um, Alexandria actually died in that fight story with, probably nothing, it just rolls you back. Um, but yeah, it is very interesting what would happen. And there are a lot of cool what ifs. What, what if this, what if that, what would happen? Um... I like the fight with the baker. Listen, that was creepy. That was really creepy. And, and I loved it. I loved it. Like, yeah, I loved it. And I really don't have any negative. Like, I don't have, like, any ugly. There's not much that I can say that's a problem. Listen, I think the price point's good. Um, it's an indie game. I think it's fair. Uh, I think... The story is really good. I think the playtime is amazing. That was, what, like seven hours? Um, and we did most everything. I guess we missed some things. Um, but, like, we covered a lot of quests. Again, I didn't go to 100% it. I wasn't interested in getting every last bit and tittle. But, uh, you know, really impressive for what it is. And I have to say, I do like it. Um. DLC is a few more missions. I honestly do not think we'll have DLC. I personally don't see that coming. Um, I kind of feel like this will be what it is. 
Um, but, you know, again, for what it is, it was good. It was really good. It, um, if you die early on in the game, you will know that Alex had some sort of time-based power. She will comment after... Yes, yeah, she does comment. Um, she definitely does. If you fail something, she will comment and be like, I need to do this or I need to do that. Um... And the game makes it really apparent anyways really early on because she does see something and go, no, 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 you can't do that. And then, you know, changes it. But as players, I don't think we realize what that actually is. And then the game goes, well, this is what's going on. And I like it. Um, I like that the guys throw hammers. I like that they shoot arrows. I, I just, the combat was cool. I don't know. I have no complaints. I <coughs> would have liked... Yeah, um, an option to play a particular scene would be awesome. It would, but it doesn't fit the way that this game works. Um, though, I mean, theoretically, I guess it could be done. Um, I mean, Last of Us 2 does that. You can choose action scenes to replay. So, I mean, maybe that's something they might look at. I don't know. See, again, I you know, who knows what the timeline or what the roadmap is. If there is a roadmap, you know, that's kind of the big question um so hey listen um we've got probably 20 minutes i'm going to go for another 20 but i want to talk a little bit because there are some things coming up that i think you want to know about um uh tomorrow is pop tail weekly we're going to be playing journey 3000 i have to post the video um you know i have to schedule the video still that is this afternoon's thing. I got to do that. I got to do all that stuff. Um, my hope is to do a chat with viewers on Wednesday. I don't know if it's going to happen because I have a meeting uh, a couple hours before the uh, episode of Pop Tale Weekly. And I have talked with you guys yesterday and today. Um, so there may not be a chat with viewers tomorrow, but there is going to be a Pop Tale Weekly tomorrow. Um, and then coming up, on September 18th and possibly into the 19th. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do like a 15, 16, 17, 18 hour marathon where I sit here for that long again. Um, I may have to break it up over two days, but um, we're, we're going to kind of wait and see. I'm going to like figure that out with my family. Um, we're going to be doing the marathon and I've got a lot of cool stuff planned. I want to tell you some of the stuff that's listed here. Uh, and kind of describe a little bit to you so you know. Um, we're going to be playing Super Liam. I'm going to be doing a sort of commentary playthrough. Um, Athir might join me for that. I don't know what his schedule is like, but he wanted to be on that because he was around for a lot of the development and um, can probably tell some cool stories. We're going to be doing a crazy party guess the coins, and what that is is you have to guess how many coins I can earn in Crazy Party in two hours. And the plan is to do two hours of adventure. So um, I will, you know, you guys will guess, and then the one who comes closest without going over will win a prize. Um, I will also be doing Crazy Party where I unlock the light world. Originally, it was a stream I wanted to do this week. But I kind of want to save it for the marathon. Um, also, oh, hold on just a quick sec. Oh, well, that's not legit, so we're not going to answer it. Thanks, New Hampshire, uh, New Hampshire, uh, Manchester, New Hampshire. I'm not answering your call. Um, so we're going to unlock the light world, and uh, that's going to be a mess. Uh, probably play a little Screaming Strike. Uh, we might check in with the Vortex uh, as we go along. I'm going to reset that game. And we'll check in with it. I might spend a little bit on um, getting updates and stuff. Um, we're going to play Mud Splat. If you've never played that game, that's a good old good old audio game. I'm going to give that a whirl. That'll take like 20, 30 minutes. I'll probably play Escape Beat. It's not even on this list, but I'm putting it on this list because you guys know me. I love Escape Beat. So I'll probably do a run through of that. Um, we're going to be doing some online crazy party games. We're going to be playing some Quiplash. Um, maybe even some swamp. I have it here as a possibility. Um, but here's what you guys want to know about. This is the fun part. Every year, there's always some sort of little gimmick. 
Uh, always some fun little donation gimmick. And uh, this year, I am bringing back the Wheel of Pain. We're bringing back the son of the Wheel of Pain. And let me tell you, this wheel has got some fun stuff on it. And um, what makes this wheel extra fun is it's also got good things on it. And so I've got everything from, I'm not going to read out the whole list because that would ruin the fun. But it's got everything from eat a Carolina Reaper infused jelly bean to um, uh, eat, eat a haichu. If you don't know what haichus are, they're delicious. Um, there's also some other fun things involved like um, me attaching clothespins to my ears and nose and uh, some other disgusting things I might be eating or trying. Um, so that is uh, going to be a donation thing. It would probably be every $50. We'll spin the wheel, see what comes up. Um, we'll kind of do the standard one hour adds an hour up to a maximum of 10. Um, but we're going to kind of wait and see how it goes and play it from there. Um, I have to, again, I have to look at what my family is doing, what they're okay with, what, um, is going to work and also have to, you know, be cognizant of how much noise I am making, um, as I live with others, and so I can't be up at three in the morning going, hey, here's another spin of the wheel. Um, so we're going to talk about that, kind of see what we can do. Um, yeah, Roland says marathon, marathon, yay. Yeah, um, and I got cool, and actually I have some really cool stuff for next year's marathon that I don't have um, set up in time. But um, this year is going to be fun. Next year, I'll probably do the wheel again, but I've got some crazier things. <coughs> um, I got some crazier things uh, for next year. Uh, Stephen says, I can't wait for the marathon. Of course, I'll be doing about the... Oh, we have one more little thing. Um, I'm still in the process of trying to configure it. I cannot guarantee that it's going to work the way I want it to work. Um, but what we'll have is one of two things. Um, either... We'll have a chat bot that reads out chat messages in my voice if you've donated or are a patron. Um, or we're going to have a system that will read all the Streamlabs donations messages, whether they're donations or super chats, um, in my voice. Um, so that is a cool thing. Liam Bot will be making his official, um, you know, entrance on uh, the marathon. And uh, I'm still working out how I want to do that because um, you got to be careful with that because I know people are going to have a little fun, uh, maybe try to make them say some things that I wouldn't normally say. Um, so we're going to kind of look at the logistics of that. So one of those two things is going to happen. I don't know which one yet. Um, some crazy sauces in there, too. Um, not this year. I actually got very sick after doing that. Um so I have to be a little careful. I was very ill after doing the hot sauce. I was sick. I have, let me just say that. Um, I don't want to do that to myself again. The The jelly beans are really as far as I want to go. And they won't happen every time. So that's why I don't mind doing them. Because I know they're not going to be as... They're going to hurt a lot. I mean, they're they're definitely going to hurt. But they won't be the same level of pain as the sauces would be. I, I hope they won't. I, I might regret that decision. Um, but uh, yeah, Son of Wheel of Pain is going to be interesting. I have to code that this week. Um, I have to do a little work on that. And then um, we'll have Liam Bot. He will... Um, he'll. You know what? Why don't I, for the last few minutes, let's put Liam Bot up. Now... I'm only going to whitelist certain people. Um, otherwise, it will get a little insane. But let's... I don't even know if Liam Le Bot's going to run, actually. I don't know if I have him in a... Uh, a like... A, a mode that's going to work. But why don't we try him? Let's stress test him. No no time like the present. Um Oh, geez. No, he's not running. Okay, hold on. 
He's not running. Uh, time to do some debugging in real time. Devico and donated 40 rupees through Super Chat. Thank you so much for the uh, Super Chat. See if I can do it right, then the Liam voice will read that. Oh, indentation error. Unexpected indent. Uh, line 36. All right. So don't mind me while I fix this. All right, line 36. Oh. Uh oh. Oh no. What? Whoa, what? Oh, I know why. I know why. Okay, we can't run this today. Um I I know exactly why. I need to make I think I've got to make a new Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I got to make a new key and I don't really remember which uh, account I used to build it. Do I really have to make a new invalid, invalid grant, bad request. Ah, I'm going to have to generate a new token now. Trenton says, spicy jelly beans, be careful. Please be careful. Well, uh, just so you know, Liam, you did say some things you didn't normally say. Yes, I do remember. Uh, one famous wheel spin. One very famous wheel spin. Um, man, that sucks. I don't want to generate new credentials. Son of a biscuit. Okay, so Liam Bot's not going to work today. Um... I'm glad I actually checked that because I thought that the credentials were good, but I don't know if they expire or if something is incorrect, but um, they are no, no good. Unless I can, can I spit out some new creds? Let me see. Hold on. I'm going to try to re... Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? Hold on. Just a quick sec. This might actually still work. What? Oh. All right. Now my thing's completely broken. How does that not have... What? Okay, I... Okay, that makes no sense. Am I supposed to run a... thing to get those credits? Right. Oh, man. I haven't done this in so long. I need to authorize, and I don't remember how to do it now. I thought it was just create. Did it modify this? No. That looks, looks right. Um, I mean, this looks okay. I don't know what I'm, uh, am I supposed to run something separate? I don't know. Obviously, 
this isn't going to work at the moment. I got to pull up my instructions. You know, I did this like a month ago and I forgot that I made some changes to my account and I have a feeling that that's why the OAuth is no good now. Um, oh, I looked through the whole archive to find that particular spin. Oh, did you find it? Because I don't remember where it was. I got to find that. It was so great. I, I'd love to clip that actually. That was an amazing clip. Well, we'll have to clip that because yeah, my just anger and frustrate because that wasn't that when I was like, yeah, I'll do an extra one and I doubled it and then I really paid for it. That was pretty funny. Oh my God. Um, so I got to remember how to run OAuth um, because for whatever reason, I'm, I thought I could just run the. Let me see here. Do I have to physically? Uh, I don't remember. Reader. Yeah, so I'm missing. Oh, with creds. Um, let's see. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Isn't there? Oh, right, because so I'm using this thing called YouTube chat, and it's just a wrapper around. So it requires. I hope you guys don't mind. I'm going to like do coding as I talk, as I sit here. Um, I kind of want to get this to work now. If you guys are bored by this, I can just leave if that's going to be easier. Um, uh, there's something relaxing hearing some more work on code. Okay, well, then uh, th then we'll uh, keep going for a little bit. All right, so I need to get the OAuth. Do I need to run something? Oh man, I did this and I can't remember what I did now. I got to write things down. My memory is getting bad. I like I did this back in July and I had no problem once I generated the key to get this to work. And now I can't remember how I how I twig this to go is it I wonder if my client secret stuff has been modified whoa what the heck was that thing let's get rid of that um that might have been a bug that's gross um let me see okay Still 25 of you hanging out. Um, also, thank you so much again. Thank you so much for the super chat. Um, I do appreciate when you guys do that. It is very helpful. Um, like I, I think I mentioned this earlier. Things have been a little crazy right now. So any anything is 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 definitely helpful. Um, I don't have, it shouldn't modify that. 
I'm just looking to see if I ended up. Oh. Oh, that's not it. That's not it. That's, um. Or is it? No, maybe it's not. Might be. Uh, man, I don't know. So, um, now I'm not sure if I... Wow, so I did this back on July 29th. And now I can't remember if this is the secrets I was supposed to use or I'm going to try this. See if this does it. Mhm. <laughs> Oh, oh. It's doing something. Oh, that didn't work. No, there's no... So I need something to generate the credits. And now I don't know how to do it. Am I supposed to run, let's see here, just one quick, generating OAuth, all right, let's see here. This is not what I'm looking for. Uh. All right, let me see here. Found something. No, that's not what I'm looking for. Remember anymore? Uh, no. Okay, so I'm gonna bail on this for right now. Uh, that's why I start to more and more appreciate the simple things in life. Uh, one note is, yeah, I, I just, you know, I did it, and I was like, I'll never have to do it again. Famous last last words, and apparently that's not correct. All right, so. We're going to end the stream for today. It's uh, 12 o'clock, so 1 Eastern. Um, I will be back tomorrow with more Poptail Live. We will be checking out um, Journey 3000. So um, I do want to thank you guys for watching. And uh, before I go, I want to thank my patrons one more time. Could not do it without them. Uh, please consider becoming a patron if you haven't already. So big thanks to Wandering Waves, Danny Combs, Michael Lyle, Kyle Smith, Munawar Vajani, James Dean, Jim Denham, Anya Kristen, Trevor Johnson, Kevin Lyon, Stephen Luttrell, Simon Yeager, Shane Davidson, Austin Nix, Sarah Hawk, Jason Smith, Michael Welty, Luna Raven, Heather Messaker, Audio Game Geek, Melissa Rowe, Hillary Duncan, Ashley Coleman, Bianca, Shane Early, Courtney Barton, Bryant, Roland Engelsma, Abdullah Dubase, Changeling, Chad Blanco, and Jack Filichek. So thanks to all of you who um, make this possible. I will be back soon, and we'll have some more frivolity and craziness. Uh, hopefully tomorrow we're going to do Poptail, and uh, there may or may not be a chat stream. I can't guarantee it. Um, was working with Ethereum to do a Quiplash After Dark thing. Um, I don't know if we're going to get to that 
anytime soon just because things that are going on here. But uh, if we can, we will do it. So uh, again, I want to thank you guys for being here. I could not do it without you. I'm glad that you showed up for the veil and big congrats to our winner, Mad uh, Matthew. Um, I will make sure I get him his prize. And um, yeah, so this was a success. Veil was great. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you all soon. As always, thanks for watching and or listening. Good night and good corn. <laughs>